If you are new to Microsoft SQL Server 2022 and is looking for a sample database to work with, then Microsoft AdventureWorks database is a great choice as the database comes with more than 30 tables, pre-built reports, and many other features. So currently, the uh, latest version of the Microsoft AdventureWorks database is from SQL Server 2019. And I suspect that the 2022 version will get released in a couple of months. Once the sample database for SQL Server 2022 is released, you can follow the same instruction to upload the sample database. Now let's look at how we can download and upload the AdventureWorks sample database to SQL Server 2022. All right, so first we need to navigate to AdventureWorks sample databases page. And I'll link the link in the description below. All right, so let me scroll down to download backup files. So here we have three different versions of backup files. OLTP, which is uh, for most typical online transaction processing workloads. And the OLTP backup file basically comes with everything, including other additional features. First, the uh, data warehouse version, mostly containing the reports and the tables. And the lightweight version will comes with very limited report and tables. Now for this demonstration, I'm going to download the OLTP version. So here I'm going to click on AdventureWorks 2019.bak file. I want to save the backup file in the backup folder. And the folder directory is going to be uh, under your C drive, program file, Microsoft SQL Server, followed by MS SQL 16. And which is going to be the folder for SQL Server 2022. MS SQL Server 01 dash MS SQL backup. Now make sure that you save the BAK file in the backup folder, then save the file. Now we need to launch our SQL Server Management Studio. Right, so once you connect to your database, you want to uh, expand the Object Explorer uh, panel. Now right click on Databases. Now here you want to select Restore Database. And the Restore Database window is going to launch. Now here you want to choose Device. Then click on this uh, dot 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 icon. And it's going to ask you to browse the backup file. Now here, make sure that your backup media type is set to file. Then you want to add the file, click on add. Now basically at this point, you want to navigate to the backup folder and select the BAK file. Then click on OK. OK again. And that's going to basically attach the sample database. Then click on OK. And that should be it. Now, if the process is successful, then you're going to see database followed by the database name, restore it successfully. Now, looking at my object explorer, and here's the AdventureWorks 2019 database. If I expand the folder, I should now see all these tables that I can uh, use to play around with. If I scroll down to the views uh, folder, and here we have some of the uh, pre-existing pre built reports that you can check it out. So this is going to be everything I'm going to cover in this video and hopefully you guys find this video as well. And feel free to post your question or your feedback in the comment section below. And don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you guys next time. Bye bye.